right, so today I'm doing a comparison between this Aria DM01. Um, it's sort of a offset surf guitar based on the um, the old Mosrites and the Univox High Flyer. Uh, I'm going to compare it against the Squire Deluxe Jazzmaster. Um, yeah, price-wise, these are around 275 brand new in the UK. Um, I've in my previous video I did about this, a lot of people are saying they don't really get them in America, but um, in Europe they're quite uh, common. They come in three colours, sunburst, black, and this vintage white. Um, the Deluxe Jazzmaster is basically a uh, Jay Mascus Jazzmaster, um, pretty much the same guitar, just a different colour. Um, so spec-wise, uh, they're pretty similar to be honest, uh, both got P90 style single coil pickups, um, both got 25.5 inch scale necks, um, the wiring on this is a bit more simple, it's just got the sort of lead circuit as you'd have on that, so you've just got the three-way control switch, so neck, middle, bridge with just a one volume tone control. Um, obviously I'm going to be using the uh, Jazzmaster Deluxe on the lead circuit, so again it'll just be the same setup with a three-way control switch. Um, they've both got the sort of similar vibrato, it's got the fender style, just like the Jazzmaster. They've both got tunematic bridges, um, they're both uh, rosewood fingerboards. The only difference being with the necks is these are a 12 inch uh, radius, these are a 9.5 inch radius. Um, both got the same strings on, I've set them up the same. Um, both got basswood bodies. Uh, the Aria's got modern style tuners, the Jazzmaster's got uh, vintage style tuners, so price wise, again, these are 275 in the UK at the minute. The Jazzmaster's uh, are around two, £282 at the minute in the UK, so there's about £7 difference. These are really cheap at the minute, I've got a feeling they're um, discontinuing them. Um, but yeah, they're doing a lot more of the contemporary range has just come out and they're made in the China factory so I reckon they're knocking these out so if you want one of these you need to be pretty quick I reckon they really are a great guitar um, yeah it's got the tortoise pick guard the deluxe has got the anodized pick guard uh, that's about it really but um, yeah it's going to play some sounds on them a bit of clean a bit of lead a bit of distorted on three different positions so Let's plug them in and see what they sound like. Right, so I've got the area plugged in now, so I'm going to play a bit of clean. This is the neck pickup on its own. so both the single call pickups working together now.
this is just the bridge pickup on its own now. So moving on to a bit of distortion now, this is the neck pick up on its own. <laughs> So in the middle position now, so both these single call pickups working together. <laughs>
Okay, so you're gonna play a bit of lead now, so this is just the neck pickup. <laughs> So both the single call pickups working together. Jazzmaster and the Area DM01. Um, pretty similar guitars in terms of the setup with a single chord pickup, tunematic bridge, and the Fender style vibrato. Um, both got the rosewood fingerboards, 25.5 inch scale. Um, setup pretty much the same with the same strings. So, yeah, let me know what you think in the comments below. Again, price wise, 282 in England at the minute, 275, so literally £7 between the two. Um, yeah, you've got your sort of Univox High Flyer, Mosrite sort of style going on there, and you've got your sort of classic Fender Jazzmaster style on the um, Squire. So again, let me know, comments below what you think, whether you prefer the neck, middle, bridge position, clean, distorted. But again, yeah, the area seems to be Europe only. Um, I don't know where else in the world they get them. I know America's pretty sharp on the area brand, but... Yeah, let me know what you think. Um, follow me, Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, um, Patreon, Spreadshirt, The Meat Manifesto. Um, football starts again tonight with uh, Belgium, France in the semi-finals, so that'd be a good match. Uh, England tomorrow against Croatia, so come on England. And um, that's probably about it for now, so thanks for watching. Have a good day.